The blowtorch is an extremely useful tool in the game and it's also really really quick to upgrade because there's just one option to use and that's more fuel. Now the blowtorch's basic principle is it cuts through uh, objects, so plastic, uh, metal and you can also cut through wood. Realistically though you want to be using it to cut through metal because there's a 0% chance of it setting fires. Um, it operates on a pretty simple principle that it takes a few moments of damage and then it will remove that piece of metal that you're aiming at. So you can use it to remove bars like I've done. Same with wood, uh, however the wood will set on fire so I'd avoid using um, using it on any wood whatsoever. You can also cut sections out of vehicles which was more useful before the patch. But it's still useful for example if you want to reduce a vehicle down to its chassis so you can physically carry it. Um, or if you want to reduce it in size to get it through a certain space. Also with vehicles, um, especially the crane and some of the larger vehicles, if you're positioning them and you don't want to have to keep running around and making a ledge to get up to the top for whatever reason, you can also cut sections out of vehicles to make it more convenient for you to climb them. This will contribute to the overall damage, but it's very, very minor, especially if you're just using it to get to a certain point. Uh, there are certain point parts of vehicles that can't be cut off though, so that's worth noting. Now again, you can also use this to cut through gates, I'll show you some specific techniques with doors, but cutting out little sections saves a lot of your fuel and it also means that you can um, just remove entire gates without having to make so much debris and mess. Um, if we head over to this as well, this is another example of what we can use it for. You can use this to cut your way through metal surfaces so you can get inside. Um, saves and blowing up walls, using shotguns, using bombs, making more of a mess. But you can see here, for example, we could just cut our way into this train if we like. Now a few final things. Um, we head back to the, the main area. I'll use this little oil drum uh, or barrel, whatever it's supposed to be, around the side just to demonstrate how we can cut certain sections out. So when you are chopping away at bombs and you're trying to break sections, be really careful because sometimes they have their own predefined sizes. Like for example, this one seems to remove four blocks at once. Um, and just be aware of that while you're chopping your way through things. Always point the blowtorch so that when the beam actually cuts through, so that when the flame cuts through it doesn't cut the thing behind it, especially with bombs. And again with windows you wouldn't normally be able to smash your way through, you can use the blowtorch to cut through the metal. Now it doesn't always seem to cut glass, it is in this instance with this window, so I don't know whether it's been patched, but um, if you are having issues you just then break the glass. And then you can see there we wouldn't have been able to get through that without it. Now one of the final pointers with the um, the door, um, I was going to try and cut that in front but then I realised it's uh, cut that in half but I realised it's connected to the wall. Um, if you're cutting through doors just bear in mind that you can cut through the hinges and the door will fall away. They do operate on an actual principle of the, as if they were real doors. So um, being able to cut through that saves a massive amount of blowtorch fuel. And again, if you've got any specific things that you've found or any good uses of the, uh, the blowtorch that I haven't covered, then let me know because I'll be putting together a large hints and tips video, which uh, depending on when you watch this may or may not be available um, yet, but I'll be putting that together with pretty much everything uh, in the game pull together so we can make it as easy as possible to uh, succeed in some of the harder missions.